Yes, the Winnipeg Jets, we knew that they were going to be moving up there, but guess what? The season has kicked off and it's official. Hockey is back being played in Winnipeg at the professional level in the National Hockey League. They couldn't have used too many highlights from years before, huh? They've basically taken all the highlights from the intro video from the preseason. Fair enough, you do what you gotta do. I would have liked to have seen them go back 15 years ago and you know take some of that awesome footage. But hey, you know what? I think there's only one way to describe the mood in Winnipeg. I wasn't there, but electric, I think, sums it up. Look at this place go absolutely insane. I mean, Winnipeg is a hockey-rich town. I mean, I don't think there's any question about that. Well, basically, Canada is a hockey-rich uh, country. So I think that's you know another way of looking at it. Cool introduction. Cool way of bringing the team back. I liked it. I don't necessarily like the video that much. I mean, talk about being literal. I mean, Jets. They look a Jet. Yeah, we get it. You're the Jets. I would have liked to see maybe you know the Jets spit fire at people. And it's kind of things up. It's kind of cheesy. You can make fun of it, Tyler. But I think they could show pictures of like a panda eating a bamboo stick and put the Jets logo there, and these people in Winnipeg would have gone berserk. <laughs> no way! They were, just, no way! <laughs> they were just so ready for hockey to be back. It, they could have shown them anything, and these people were so ready for hockey that place went absolutely bonkers. Well, wouldn't you cool. be? I mean, think about that, folks. I mean, a uh, place that you know all you know is hockey. Think of think of it as, I mean, I, I don't want to use the Yankees as an example, but you know. If, Take the other Jets, New York Jets, Phil, and the Jets leave you can't town even, you know, you for can't, 15 years. I see what you're saying, but it's not even to that level. It's more than that because it there's other New York teams. Exactly. You there's know? nothing else going on. I mean, think about it. In Winnipeg, what else is there to do? I mean, I honestly have never been. I don't want to go. I don't care to. But what else is there to do? I mean, Canadian football league. I have no idea. And, and these people were so passionate about the Jets, and it's really cool as – you know what the cool I thing is? I know Rasher fans are going to hate us right now because of that. No, they are. Stop but it. think of it. Think of it as from. I mean, for you guys, obviously, you do have other teams to support in Atlanta. Clearly, you have a few other teams to support. I know it's kind of tough to get behind any of them right now. Falcons losing again last night. Braves, Braves choked Braves away an eight and a half game lead. Away, yes, and uh, obviously, they're probably not going to be a basketball season this year. So I understand your pain. Maybe you do know what we're talking about then. But still, in Winnipeg, they don't even have the hopes to really look for anything else except for hockey. So to have the team back after 15 seasons is nothing short of phenomenal. I don't think there's any question about that.